big hall and I and I and I and I little hall and that guy back there that's totes ask us why <laughs> Sorry, I think the lighting might be a little bit dark, but I'm going to try to do one more haul today. I tried to do this haul a while back, and the, the lighting just, I didn't, it was bad. So anyway, this is kind of old, you guys. I did do one back when I actually bought the stuff, but like I said, the it was too dark. So um, I didn't end up putting it out, but I just thought I'd do a haul and just show you what I get from Michael's a couple weeks ago. Um... They had their fifty dollar um, fifty bin. Uh, they had put everything into a bin from the collection that was a dollar fifty before, and marked it fifty cents. So I got quite a few things out of there, and then uh, some stamps and uh, a paper pad. So I'll just share that with you real quick. First, I got a little cupcake cup cups cupcake cups. <laughs> so. I just got one of these with the little ice cream cones on them and uh, I've, I've bought these you guys probably more for like doing layouts and stuff. I, I don't buy these real pretty designs for um, actually making cupcakes. I use them more in crafting so it's like a pink and green on the side and then it, they have um, ice cream cones on the bottom. 50 cents for that and then I got this one the lips on the bottom and then polka dots on the side 50 cents and then I got just one of these little it comes with it's like a two pack of it's a little bit thicker than chipboard I think oh, chalkboard I don't know I'm not I don't think it's chipboard I think it's too thick and too hard and there's a pack of two in there you guys probably seen these if you watch Michael's hauls anyways but I got these for 50 cents and then I got the black ones a pack of black ones for 50 cents and they have like a little ribbon through them so I don't know if they're meant to just hang like little chocolates or what I haven't opened them up yet but for 50 cents I grabbed those I found one of these he didn't have any others I wish they had because I love these but for 50 cents I was happy to at least find one and you guys know I bought um, a while back. I bought a few of these, but I f bought them for the full price, which was a dollar fifty at the time. So fifty cents, very cool on these. I'm not gonna spend too much time because I'm assuming you guys have seen a lot of this stuff. I got these little sticky notes for fifty cents. Little yellow um, word bubbles or whatever you call them. And then these sticky notes, just the lips for 50 cents. Pretty decent sized pack of them, 280 sheets. Uh, <laughs> little mustaches. Cupcake cups with this. Uh, this is, I love this red and white stripes on the side. Make some really cute flowers or embellishments out of this. The black and white with the mustache on the bottom. But again, I bought it more for the side part. Because you can embellish the middle. One of each of these like little doy paper doilies that they had. Um, 50 cents. They had a lot of them in the 50 cent bin now. But um, I just grabbed one of each. So I got the little ice cream cones. A pack of those. And there's six in each pack. And then I got the cupcake one. Like I said, you guys have probably already seen these, but I do just a little haul. And then just a single ice cream cone. And then the cupcake. And the cake. And the ice cream sundae. But these will be cute for like doing layouts and cards and things. These would be very cute. Um, or making embellishments or whatever. I just grabbed one of each of these here. Little notepads. I already took them out because I had done a haul already, but like I said, I'm redoing it. So 
um, but it's just the this is what I bought it for was the cover you guys the pens are not any good they stink <laughs> but the, I mean how cute you know for I already like I said I already did a that's how they wrote they did write but I, they were really flimsy pens here so but anyway they just have just regular plain old sheets inside um, but they're nice for like inside your purse and stuff and then later you can use these covers and I bought this one too later you can use the covers for like an embellishment or something or a card or whatever you want to I know you guys have heard me say this many times how I like to use um, like tissue paper and things like that for um, decoupage in like drawers and any kind of furniture I might be working on or whatever um, but I did find one of each of these kind of napkins and I was thinking maybe because these are they're they're actually pretty thick and you know they're fully printed there's print on all you know all over it here they have all these cute little dresses on it so I just grabbed one pack of those again 50 cents because these are all these were all clearance down I don't know if your Michaels will have any of these left or not but mine had quite a two a big huge bin on and it was full on both sides so but you had to dig <laughs> so I grabbed one of those and then I grabbed one with the um, uh, lipsticks on it and I think this one oh here we go this is what this one looks like I like the black and white um, but that's what the whole thing looks like so I grabbed those hoping that maybe I could use them in a project they're pretty cute you know so there you go guys and then um let's see what else did I get from the 50 cent bin I got some uh, like rick rack and ribbon I guess you would you guys are calling it the airmail uh, rick rack and ribbon type I got one of those one of those they kind of had like different colors so this one's like a tan the other one was red and the blue and then just one of these with the airmail type um, clothes pins they had tons of that you guys I got like three packs of these 50 cents for all four of these little frames is a pretty good deal and I think you could you know if you're not happy with the white you could spray paint them a different color or paint them a different color some of the shabby chic cards which I'm so glad because you know I, I love shabby chic um, but I chose not to buy them when they were a buck fifty so to see them in the 50 cent bin was wonderful and so I got this one for 50 cents these are so pretty and I think these would make a really beautiful um, pocket letter and if if they fit in there I'm assuming they would <laughs> or they could be cut down maybe or whatever and I got that one and this one and this one I think those are the only ones I was able to find but they're really pretty I think this one's probably my favorite here the roses and then um, they had some of the notebooks too so I grabbed a few of those and I love these because uh, 50 cents for this I mean first of all that's a great deal and then what I really love is that the papers on the inside actually have the design uh, are have designs on them. notebook has the same design but still I mean if you take these pages out to write your notes put in your pocket letters or whatever um, that would make really pretty paper for that so I bought that because especially well because of the beautiful covers and the beautiful back but it was only 50 cents I think you get probably 60 to 80 sheets in here and they're designed which you can't go wrong with that and then I did pick up I actually picked up two packs of these little stick pins with the lips and I'm thinking if I can get the stick pins off there I will probably use these for embellishing things so because I love the little lips 
and they had several of these still left. I think there was mustaches too, but I, I, eh, I don't know. Those mustaches don't really appeal to me. These were a buck fifty each, and I got this with the butterflies and the bee and the butterfly, the bee and the ladybug. They're just little stamps. And then this one with like the key, the crown, the flourish, and the cross. And then this one, of course, with the little cupcakes. And it says sweet and yum. I'm sorry I didn't say that. And then this one, I've looked at it a couple times and finally grabbed it with the little banners. Those are cute. I like those. You can use these over and over and over again. So, like I said, these were only a buck fifty, you guys. So not bad. And then um, that day, let's see. I think now, forgive me, guys. It's been a while, but I'm pretty sure. I want to say I got these both for fifty percent off. So, um, I think I paid five dollars for this because it was fifty. I think I believe I believe it was. 50% off, so it was like five bucks for the little camera stamps. And this is by Inka Dinka Doo. And they're the clear stamps, but just really cute cameras. My grandfather used to collect cameras, so. But I don't know what my mom ever did with all his vintage cameras. I have no clue. Aren't those cute? So I love these. I was really excited to get them. And then this one, uh, Little Hall and I decided to get. And I think we got this one for half price, and I think it was like $6. Somewhere in the $6 range. And these are all, they're clear stamps, and they're all disconnected. So, like, I'm assuming you can kind of just change up what they're wearing or whatever. But I love the little um, umbrella in there, and just the cute little faces. Those will be fun to play with. Hopefully you can make them out, you guys. And this is by um, Stampendous. Yep. So, oh, and I, you know what? I I did open. Did I? Oh, I opened it up. That's why it's upside down. So forgive me, you guys. I did open some of the stuff up to do the haul, and like I said, that haul didn't work out. So I'm just trying to do it over again, so you can at least see what I have. And then uh, I just picked. I have a lot of ribbon myself but so every once in a while I'll just grab one or two here if they're cheap and they're cute um, and this one I don't know, it was kind of cute so I grabbed it and it was in the dollar bin and it has let's see three yards on it for a buck that ain't too bad but I don't have anything like that so I thought that was cute and then last got another shabby chic looking paper pack with my some of my favorite colors the pink the teal and um, this I got I believe for oh, right around six dollars it was 70% off so um, I'll just flip through it really quick for you guys this should be a pretty quick haul so we'll just flip through here hopefully you're getting a nice look at this I think this is beautiful. I love this page. This page. Hopefully you can see that. Isn't that pretty? I love it. It's beautiful. And it's got the, um, the dots are like gold foils. So really pretty. Beautiful. I love the little teacups. Those were done very, very beautifully. Um, and this, oh, this one is called Tea Party, you guys. That's what it's called. I don't want to go too fast, but I don't want to be like too slow either. I love the colors scheme. That's beautiful. Aren't those darling? Love this page. Hopefully you can see that okay, you guys. Love that page. <laughs> those teacups. Perfectly done. I have a lot of vintage teacups, so um, this one's real pretty. Gold foiling and roses. And the roses are kind of raised. The bird cages. There 
you go. That one's beautiful. So that's about it, you guys. And that, I think that, yep, there's more foiling polka dots. And then, oh yeah, they have the front page has just, there's not a lot of cards. It's just one page of the uh, cards. But they are quite, quite beautiful. So... There you go guys so that's it that was that was my Michaels haul I think there's a few things missing that I probably used or put away but um, like I said I actually got this a, about two weeks ago so I don't know if you're really even gonna care about it but I wanted to get it done and out of the way so I can put everything away and that's it I think that's all I'm gonna get in today you guys so I do have one more no, two more hauls that I really want to get done but um, uh, it's getting too dark so maybe tomorrow you guys have a wonderful wonderful evening and a great day tomorrow and we'll see you again shortly thanks guys happy hauling <laughs>